Hi everyone and welcome to episode one of Team Talk with Richard Gray. July was a fantastic month for Harcourt South Africa. In fact, it was our second best month ever. And we had some huge achievements by some of our officers and agents. Personal bests, lots of records. Our top five officers were Harcourt's Platinum, Rhino, Hilton, Maritz and Zambezi. So congratulations to all of you. Really, really big numbers that coming out of those five officers. Our top five agents were Michael Pashley, Quirti Salia, Daphne Mackay, Dean Thomas, and Dave Brown. Well done to all of you. You're setting some big standards for everybody else to follow. Recently, we've opened two new officers. And we're very proud to have both of them on board. One of them from Soweto, Harcourts Unlimited, headed up by Mike Mangena. Very, very excited to have someone in Soweto. We've been waiting a long time to open an office in Soweto. And to have Mike and the team on board is really great. On the East Strand, we have Lydia van der Merwe, who's opened up Harcourt's Elite. And their main focus is on the top end of the market. Once again, really good to be involved in the top end of that East Strand market. We know you guys will be very successful and we look forward to having a long and happy stay and working with you at Harcourt's. We know you'll be good. We've got a new corporate team member as well this month, and that's AJ Cochran, who's joined us as the BDM for the inland region. He'll be working closely with Julian Buckmaster, our existing BDM. And AJ really adds a lot to the team. Not only is he young and energetic, which we need, uh, but also, is also someone who's got a terrific work ethic and a thirst for, for knowledge. So welcome, AJ. It's good to have you on board. Slightly sad note is that Tina Sander, who's our head of international, who's our contact at Harcourts International as well, has decided to leave her job. Uh, she is staying on at Harcourts and is joining one of the Harcourts offices, but we're very, very sad to see Tina go, and we will definitely miss her. Thank you very much, Tina, for everything you've done for us. Uh, there's no doubt a lot of our success comes from what you've brought to the table. Thank you. We've also had some terrific mandates that we've received in the last little while through our luxury property selection brand. Not only did we achieve a 120 million rand sole mandate in Cape Town not so long ago, I heard yesterday we've now managed to secure a 350 million rand mandate. One can't even think of numbers like that. Uh, what a terrific achievement by our officers down in Cape Town, really grabbing that luxury property brand and showing that we can operate in that market against some competitors who are used to uh, operating on there on their own. Well, very exciting for us in terms of our luxury property brand. Please watch out for Supersport next month. We will be on there. As you know, we sponsored the National Show Jumping Championships, and they're probably going to be between 8 and 11 episodes showcasing that event on Supersport with the Harcourts branding everywhere. We'll send through those times. Make sure you watch it. You'll be very proud to be part of Harcourts when you see that. Well, we are now in August. Can you believe it? And before we know it, we're going to be at the end of the year. From here, things just speed up. Certainly my experience that suddenly we'll be all turning around saying, boy, where did that year go? What we are doing right now today will really determine on how successful the rest of the year is going to be. It's way too late to leave it till November to try and have a big push to have a good year. So if you set yourself some goals for the year, if you are behind where you should be now, you've got to start making some serious plans to catch up because the rest of this year is going to go quickly. If you are on target, or even slightly better than target, you should be evaluating where you are and saying, what can I do to really exceed my expectations this year? So I would really recommend that everybody focuses very hard on where they are now and what they're going to be doing for the rest of the year. Plan it out exceptionally carefully. Know what you've got to do every single month between now and December to be able to turn around and say, I had a great year and a fantastic year. This is not the time of the year to lose your way. So focus hard. We're all doing that here. Thanks very much for listening to this first episode. I'd welcome any comments or suggestions. We're on Twitter. Richard Gray 9 or Team Talk, go and follow us. There's some really interesting stuff coming out on Twitter. And remember, if you post anything on Facebook or tweet yourself, the hashtag Team Talk is what you've got to do. Have a great month, 
and I look forward to chatting to you in September. Cheers.